simple interest continued. Uh, the reason we're calling this continued is because I did one on simple interest a while ago. So this one basically we're going to uh, probably go through this topic a little quicker than the other one, and we're going to do some harder examples. Now we've got all our we've got our formula, we've got our terminology here. If you want to read through it, but we're just going to get right into the example. Ben has an investment of thirty five thousand dollars that basically means he's put 35 grand in the bank right and on this investment this 35 grand he receives a simple interest rate of 6.7 percent per annum and question a wants to know how how much interest will he receive after two years and three months so let's look at all our terminology uh, we want to calculate the interest and we do that by using the formula i equals prn our principal is the amount you borrow or the amount you invest. So in this case, he's invested 35 grand. Our interest rate is the 6.7%, uh, but um, we've got to always divide this by 100. And what that does is it converts it from a percentage to a decimal, which gives you 0 0.067. Notice that we basically got the same, the 6 and the 7, but it's we just move it further away from the decimal point okay next is n which is the number of time periods now it says two years and three months and and we need to put this in years so what you can do is a couple of things first of all three months is one quarter of a year and the way i know that is if i look at three out of 12 if i look at three months out of 12 months that's the same as a quarter so n is two and a quarter since it has to be in years and it's better if you write it as a decimal so 2.25 for n all right now we go back to our formula to calculate our interest we take our principal the 35 grand we multiply it by r 0 0.067 and then we multiply it by the number of years which is 2.25 Grabbing my calculator, 35 grand times 0 0.067 times 2.25, and it gives me um, 5,276 dollars and 25 cents. Oh, 76 dollars actually. I've, I've made a, an error here. $276.25. All right, question B, what will his investment be worth after this time? So we know that he started with 35 grand and he's received interest of $5,276.25. So now altogether he has $40,000 and 25 cents.